Hi everyone, Miss Trudy is back. You know, she has been absent for the past one month plus. Uh, this is because she says she wanted to relax. Her husband, Maya, what Maya has explained that they were hit by a rock and they have to sit down, go back, reflect, and start again. So they are back. So Miss Trudy said that she has been getting a lot of uh, people DMing her in her Instagram grand page in her facebook asking her why are you not wearing your wedding ring remember the wedding ring signifies a woman that is married and we all know that she got married to maya in 2021 and people may think that a lot of things are happening or maybe they are not in good terms but most really now in her latest video that she came which we are going to show you down but we're trying to explain to you the basics so that you know who is today she's from kenya she's a youtuber married to maya she has now explained the reason why she's not wearing her wedding yeah, ring and it is not something that is really really bad but check out the video uh, from the video you know the reason why and we are all human and everybody is bound to make mistakes or anybody is bound to have something that will happen to him so chair sit back and listen to how uh the reason why she stopped using her wedding it is not something that is bad so we are happy that miss trudy you are back to our face you have you as such a kind of uh, positive vibe you and your husband you've been inspiring us doing so many good things that are really good so check out why she has not been wearing her wedding gown and you understand that she is not asking me truly what's going on truly what's up why are you not wearing your ring uh, you guys noticed hey yeah, you guys you guys are just smart and sharp like you guys notice the smallest things is crazy like it's crazy i've been getting these comments so many of them in my videos i didn't even know how to answer you guys but since they keep coming even in the last video i uploaded and I thought, you know what? Let me let you guys in. There's nothing wrong. There's everything is fine. The reason I've not been wearing my ring is because I had removed it when I was in Accra, and then I misplaced it. I don't know where I put it. And then I had to go back to Takwarade, and everything happened so fast. I then I just didn't know where my ring was. So when Maya was in Accra before he left the country, he gave me a call and he was like, oh, I found it. I was like, oh, thank God. He found it under the bed somewhere. And I was like, thank God. Because, oh, man, that thing is, 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 is expensive. Like, it's expensive. And, and I wouldn't want to lose it. Plus, it's not, not just about the cost, the value. You know, it, it's my ring, my wedding ring. So, honestly, I was kind of scared I lost it. And I didn't even know what to tell Maya, you know. He called me and was like, where's your wedding? I'm like, um, it's somewhere in the room. He looked for it until he found it. So, yeah. So, now that I'm back in Accra, I might, I will, I will. I will put it back on so yeah those of you who have uh, been asking where's your ring why not sharing your ring what's going on now you know so i've been waiting for my uber my bolt but i just got the notification that it's here so let's go okay guys so i'm just gonna be here waiting for the driver to come back he just came back to open for me so i can put the bag ghanians are so kind like i feel i honestly feel like ghanians are some of the kindest people in anyway as i was saying hey guys so i've not even told you guys so see me see i was chilling for my bag to come and then i saw a bag that looks like mine but <laughs> i wasn't sure it was mine so i moved closer to the bag and i saw down there like something is broken and i'm like no this can't be my bag because my bag is kind of new like this can't be it then i look well and i'm like yeah this is my bag I, I i took it i'm like oh my god it's my bag and it's broken i just felt so bad like uh, this bag like first of all it was a gift when i was in uh, was it california i was gifted it was quite expensive and i love it so much and then you know though it's a small bag i can travel with it anywhere 
um if i don't even have to check it in today i checked it in but i don't have to check it in i can go into the plane with it i um, mean see the thing i told you guys that when you're traveling don't always when i was in the u.s i was moving from california to new york they messed me up they they misplaced my my luggage and um for days i was in new york without clothes you know because all my clothes were in that particular bag and they they took it to i don't know if they they took it to washington dc i don't know but i didn't get my bag when i was in new york and that's when i was advised by my friend called christine that when you're traveling always have another bag on the side where you put your clothes um so that in case they they misplace your bags you'll have your at least you know a couple of clothes that you can wear so that's when i got this small bag so i feel like i like it so much i put my special stuff <sighs> yeah that's when they gifted me i didn't get it so now i'm like how is it broken it's not even a year old i'm like Wait, but it reminded me of a video my brother sent me a couple of weeks ago of how people at the airport just miss um mistreat our bags like the way they throw our bags like there's not it's like they're angry i was like wow